a lot of folks maybe want to get out there this weekend and enjoy some fall weather. We're just waiting for this rain to move out. I know there are so many things that I can't wait to start doing. Pumpkin patches, yes, you know, apple all that picking, kind of stuff. Yeah. Right, but the weather just hasn't been good for any of it. Right. But this afternoon will be okay and tomorrow will be fantastic. Okay, good. So make your plans. Uh, we did have quite a bit of rain out there yesterday, that's for sure. And in fact, many locations across the state got anywhere from two to as much as over five inches, especially in Fairfield County. The Norwalk area, just about five and half inches of rainfall in one day. Just unbelievable. Windsor locks a little over four inches and we're actually adding on to that a little bit today. Newington a little over three. Same thing with Brantford, Tolland and uh, New London about two and a half. But again we're going to add to some of these numbers and it's the same storm system that's bringing us more rain today. It just won't be the intensity that we saw yesterday. So it'll be off and on rain. Um, and of course we still have some of these river flood warnings going on. So keep that in mind if you live near the Farmington River, uh, the Housatonic River, the Still River. We have minor to moderate flooding going on through the day today, so we'll keep you posted as to any changes. But if you live near those rivers, you're likely noticing some of that flooding going on. All right, we have quite a bit of rainfall across the state right now. This is all thanks to that area of low pressure kind of rotating some rain back in our direction as it passes away from us. So some of the areas getting hit the hardest right now is uh, Voluntown really getting a pretty good downpour right now. And that downpour is headed over towards Griswold in Norwich, Canterbury, Brooklyn, all getting some rain right now. Same thing with Chaplin. And we also have some rain coming on the New Haven area. So along 95 from Milford up to Guilford actually getting some of the rain. Whenever you see those darker shades of oranges and yellows, again, that's a heavier downpour. And in the Hartford area, we were dry, but notice that that rain is rotating back in. So Glastonbury, Hartford, East Hartford and Windsor all getting some rain at this hour. And again, this will be the case through about midday today, maybe early afternoon time. And then finally, as this storm system pulls off to the east, it's going to take the rain along with it. But again, we still have several or more hours to go before we're start going to start to see some improvement here. So here is first alert future cast. I haven't stopped at about 2 o'clock. Still some ongoing showers in eastern Connecticut, but we should be dry from central Connecticut off to the west. And then actually some clearing through the late afternoon and early evening. So if you're lucky, you'll get to see a few peaks of sunshine before day's end. And again, most of the afternoon will be okay for any outdoor activities. Then tonight we clear things out, and tomorrow we have a day full of sunshine with warm temperatures, mid to even upper 70s for daytime highs. And we continue with all that sunshine all the way into Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday of the upcoming week. So finally, a nice quiet stretch of weather. The only issue is if you don't like the warm temperatures, then you might not like the midweek feel. Temperatures could be in the low to even middle 80s for a couple days next week. So right now, though, it is definitely cool. We've got the clouds. We have temperatures in the 50s across the area. Live in Waterbury, we have 52 degrees, a brisk northeast wind around 14 miles an hour, alive in Middletown showing the clouds and the showers around. And we're going to see those showers again continuing through the early afternoon before we start to dry things out and temperatures will eventually make it into the lower even mid 60s for this afternoon. So about 65 degrees in and around the Hartford area, 66 today in Enfield, 64 in Danbury and 60s along the shoreline too. We'll drop down into the 40s and low 50s overnight tonight for overnight lows with clearing skies and check out this first alert seven day forecast. It is looking spectacular. Sunshine for Sunday, sunshine all the way through the upcoming work week. Our next chance of rain not till late Friday and we'll have temperatures in the 70s and lower 80s.